Hello everyone, I'm Ajay. Welcome to Infinity Kit Training by Online Learning. Today we want to discuss uh, some of the MCQs related to uh, DBMS, uh, which came previously in MPTQ examination. Come to our first question for today. Consider a table consultant given below. Table consultant. Okay, there's a data here. Can there are queries? First, updates consultant set mobile number equal to this, where id equal 10. Where id equal 10 is the mobile number. So previously it was null. So null will be replaced with the mobile number 8967855. So on something like that. And update consultant set name equal to Rahim, where id equal 1002. With the 102, Michael will be removed and it will be updated with the name Rahim. Yeah. Delete from the consultant where gender is equal to F. So gender equal to F means these two data are there and DO will like percentage 92. Those of who don't know how, how like works, like it work, uh, works for like to check the comparison or like the pattern. So if you are using like percentile 92, then it means that percentile indicates that there can be anything. It can be any kind of data, but after uh, any kind of data, it should end with 92. So it will check the data which ends with 92. So from the two females, the answer data 92 is this one. So we need to delete this data. Yeah, this is delete. So we just left with three rows. And when we print select name, comma, gender, comma, value from the consultant, we get uh, Rahim, Ivan and Robot. Rahim, Ivan and Robot. Yes. So option A is the correct answer. Come to the next question. If an entity set E does not have enough attributes to form a primary key, then its entity set will be called as weak entity set. It means that if a entity set which uh, doesn't have enough attributes to form a primary key, and even the ER diagrams we use or uh, some certain kinds of annotations to denote such entity. entity. So those are called weak entity sets. And come to the next question, which of the following is false about the surrogate key? Mm, it's an artificial key. It is, un uh, it is uniquely identified each word. Okay. Mm, yeah, this is true about surrogate key. This is true about surrogate key. And user generated key. Uh, no, this is not a user generated key. So this becomes false. Surrogate key is not a user generated key. Come to the next question. Okay. Consider table employment detail. Okay. Select project department round of average salary sum of total bonus. So project department. Then round of sorry average salary and bonus. This is the data. Um, employee detail group by project department having average employee salary greater than 20,000 and some bonus of greater than 500. So, first is group by project department. We have one finance, telecom, ENG. So, we have finance, telecom, and ENG. Yeah. So average salary, average employee salary. So it means finance two seven thousand twenty seven thousand and uh, one more is twenty seven thousand twenty seven thousand plus twenty seven thousand divided by two. So this becomes twenty seven thousand. And the bonus for the finance is four hundred less none. So this is four hundred. Mm, yeah. And uh, next is uh, telecom, one, two, three. Telecom is 20,000, 25,000, 20,000. So it's like 40, 65,000. 65,000 divided by three, it's around 32 or something point, but it's definitely greater than 20,000. So it's there. And sum of bonus, sum of bonus means mm, telecom 300, null 300, 600. Engineering, ENG, uh, 40,000, 50,000, 90,000, and uh, 90, 120. 120 divided by 3, it's um, 40. 40,000 is our average. And the bonus, here it's null, 600 by 700, it's 1300. So we need to return the having average like greater than 20,000. All the average, uh, all the average are greater than 2,000, 20,000. 
and sum of volume greater than 500 only this case the finance doesn't satisfy so telecom engineering will return on this and from that uh, it will round off and uh, you'll just select and print that output so the question asked is when the above query is exited which are the following will as a part of output so we just need a part so finance finance will not come here and even this finance will not come where are finance we can just negative because finance will definitely not come in the output yes engineering will come in the output so option c is the correct answer for this next there's a table given on a query okay count any so first group by book book id having count in okay there's an extra query in that it's in this again select contrast are from book sale where sale location like percentile group by sale location so first is group by sale location group by sale location means um we have boston we have san francisco seattle new york detroit and again boston seattle okay and count of stars of book sale so boston is two times and uh, uh, San Francisco is one time, Seattle is two times, New York is one time, Detroit one time. Then uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, and yes, it's like like percentile. Like percentile means ends with a, ends with a settle only settle, only settle means two. So this nested query will return count as two. So this complete next set will return two here okay and the outer query group by book id having count in two okay so we need to group by book id here again book id is b1 b2 b3 so it's b1 b2 b3 are three books available and the respect to count is b1 is one two b1 is two b2 is one two yeah b2 is also two and b3 is 1 2 3 3 3 plus 4 7 so and we are we kept like group by book id having count is 2 so b3 is removed b1 and b2 are remaining and also where price is less than or equal to 40 and in the b1 price is 50 so we need to remove the b1 as well in the b2 price is 35 so b1 removed only b2 is remaining and from that we are selecting the book id that is b2 and the count that is 2 so the answer will be b2 comma 2 that is option b is the correct answer for this come to the next question tables in second normal form okay tables in second normal. okay when we are uh, dealing with normal forms uh, what actually in the table it represents is uh, first is eliminate all hidden dependencies eliminate the possibility of insertion anomalies having a composite key have all non-key fields depend on whole primary key okay so from all the options option a is the correct in the second normal form it will eliminate all the hidden dependencies there will be no multi added dependency exists for second normal form and the last question which forms are based on the concept of function de functional dependencies mm, functional dependencies or uh, one normal factor was it is okay so option three is the correct answer and the option in the third normal form we mainly check for the functional dependency so um by the question which we saw you must be aware got to know that uh, you need to concentrate on, on mostly on normal forms basic mongodb basic outputs that is select and in that also joins groups and what else um, yeah some of the ER diagram concept and also key related ER diagram concepts and key related that is primary key um, candidate key all such and surrogate key which we discussed now. so these are the topics which we focused and uh, discussed the mcqs related to that all the best thank you